Nel 2008 ci saranno nuove elezioni in Ghana, intende ricandidarsi? No, ho fatto i miei due termini e sono un uomo molto tirato. Penso che sto aiutando il mio partito, ma ho finalmente preso l'advice dei miei colleghi per sviluppare un NGO, una fondazione, you know? e sto cercando di trovare delle persone davvero buone, perché dobbiamo prendere il parola che la democrazia può solo prendere il parola se facciamo il rispetto appropriato alle persone, che mettiamo la confidenza nelle persone, e non solo questo, ma la cosa più importante è di empowerare empower le persone, non prendere il loro potere. Too often, in some parts of the world, we, we remove the power of the people into ourselves. I want to repeat it. I've said it, and I'm saying it again. We must learn to empower people. The point is that NEPAD is a new principle in the Afri uh, African Union. It says ownership of the political situation, accountability and, um, accountability and transparency. We survived as long as we did on education, Respect, accountability, transparency, and love. In other words, we did not leave our people out of anything. And you know something? The important thing is that when you take education seriously, conscientization, and you share information, you don't mystify, you demystify, you share information with your people. When you go wrong, they will never blame you because they were part of it. But when you disempower them and you have to dictate to them all the time what this, etc., etc., when you go wrong, they blame you all the time. You understand what I'm saying? And yet, if democracy has any value, besides, we're going through trying times. There is no reason to leave out your people because our people. Our people, please, our people, whether they're Africans, Alaskans, Italians, Americans, there is very little difference between us. Fundamental difference is very small. They just have to have an understanding. M my citizens cannot speak Italian. If you want to communicate with my people in Italian, you might think you're, you're stupid. Chief, if you could speak the language of my people who, who have not even been to school and try to listen to their wisdom, you'll be impressed. But you see, you've got to understand the complication, the extent to which the English colonial language has been used to intimidate our people so that their native wisdom through their own language, the best of them cannot come out because the English language is is the language by which you're used to judge whether you're intelligent or not. You get me? I need time with you. We need time, we need to continue. Sicuramente molti ghanesi che hanno espatriato la stanno guardando. Intende dire loro qualcosa? I've met a few. Personally at the airport. I've met one or two in one or two factories here. And they behaved in a very positive way towards me. And they were expressing regret about what is going on back at home. So the only advice, it's like, what, how can we get back our country, is their question. And the only advice I can really give them is, how can you organize yourselves here? Organize yourselves here to be able to assist your constituencies back at home. Yes, whether it's through the party machinery, through other, other associations, whatever it is. Things you're learning here, if you're making little earnings, how can you assist? You know, through contributions, the clinic, etc. You know, and deny your people. If you have the, the privilege of being here and you're earning a little more, please don't forget your people, okay? But, um, I mean, I... Much as I would like to speak partisan politics over here, uh, I don't particularly encourage it, even though I know they've grown disillusioned with the current party in office. So it's like they're looking for what can they do to assist our party, our party back at home. I can only really tell them as candidly as I can, 
you know, get yourselves into a very solid association, form your own, uh, choose your own leaders, and decide on what you want to do to assist the situation back at home. You know, even if you, even if you do belong to the opposition party, how can you use your influence to make sure that that bad man in your party, you know, is, 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 is brought under control or thrown out? So that we will have, even if we end up with multi-party to whatever it is, they'll, they'll be constructive. There must be a trade of logic against counter-logic. Logic against counter-logic. Not logic against illogic. That's rubbish.